what's going on my fellow rovers it's your boy back here with another weather and waves video here man so yeah man we do have the trailer for the version 1.2 here for into turquoise moon glow so i just want to show you all this nice great looking wallpaper here i like um you know the two new characters that's gonna be coming and we have the female rover here so let's go ahead and get into it man the trailer is here on the next tab then we're going to talk about a couple things let's go ahead and make that big there okay that's good so we do got some stuff okay encore is jeji right there Jian, Jin C, Chang Li. Got a crew right there. Yang Yang, Chi and Baiji. Version 1.2. Let's get it. So here's Jeji here. Turn it up a little bit for y'all. Won't give up easily, no matter who or what I'm up against. Ink drops. I think your uh, model looks great. It don't have to be Chang Li, but you know it's different. Everybody can't be Chang Li build. To create art that truly resonates. Still got a little bounce if you if you see what I'm saying. Those willing to entrust their wishes to Here's our free character here, Shang Liao. This man is dope, man. A lot of people are keep saying uh, Lee Hyper Real. <laughs> no gun though, gauntlets. I like that uh, that weapon. It looks so great. confined within limits. Seeing everyone's wishes come true and everyone enjoying the festival is enough for me. We are aware of certain so we got some things going on here. Art exchange, nursing grudges and resorting to threats. It's all my fault. A painter? Never heard of him. Really? Do we have to risk it all? You created masterpieces I wish came from me. Bold. Free. Only when you connect with your truest feelings can you create an exceptional piece of art. The wallpaper looked great. It's the one I just showed y'all. So we got the new resonators here. Go back real quick. Go a slow pulse on it. But here. We have the two resonators. As you guys know, we have Jesse here. Then, of course, we have Shang Liao, the freebie unit. I can't wait to get this guy and build him, like I told y'all, man, um, because, you know, I want to be using him more with my Yen Lin. I didn't want to fully build, um, you know, the other guy because he's a four star and he's mainly supporting. So I did not want to do that from him. So, yeah, I can't wait to build. Shane Liao is going to be um, insane. Sucks for people who built Kalkoro, but hey, it is what it is. But her art looks fine. His art looks cool. Here are the weapons. So we have a new rectifier here, and we do have uh, the gauntlet. Like I told y'all, this gauntlet looks good. Uh, Verity handle. And then we have the rhyme, drape sprout. Now I wonder what the substats are going to be on these. We'll have to wait and see. And we have the limited event here. We got some asteroids, some echoes, and some experience. So we will be going through this right here. This is gonna be fairly simple, so I'm not tripping on this. Hopefully, it's not too tedious. We don't want you don't need any tedious mini games. Then we have some experience plus asteroid right there as well we got a seven day login event so the typical we got some asteroid right echo and experience right there we have this limited time defense event here doing the spin 
as you can see here man i think they're gonna make another one here zoom in right here we're getting the phantom dreamless so here's the phantom version of the dreamless so we're gonna get some asteroid through this event and get a free phantom dreamless so of course you guys mainly will probably use this uh skin on rover because rover has that crazy multiplier with the dreamless of course so you can easily farm the dreamless since you you know if you beat that towards the end of the main story at first so you should have this uh you know echo here so that way you can just apply the skin to it so a lot of people i know got bit rover built out and of course have it rover um doing you know a lot of damage so as is so you had a free weapon as well if you got the uh you know five star selector or you got lucky the emerald genesis so yeah i can see this being used in the future and of course we wasn't going to probably be able to get no lucky to get one anyway so hey we'll take the phantom one they need to make these phantom echoes a little more exclusive though not just a skin they need to give, give us a better rarity to it they don't have to be too more crazy to stats it can just be a couple percent difference but just a plus to say hey i found a random um rare echo in the wild they need to um i mean the rate can be low whatever it can be but they just need to make it better and obtainable they're pretty useless at this point we got another ally smart smelt too i love that event that event was easy just to get experience and we have eligible returning rovers will receive corresponding rewards by completing either check-in or event tasks so say if you took a break now you're coming back they give you some asteroid, they give you some uh, fragile resin, they give you some uh, character experience, and some more things for Echo EXP and tuning. So, yeah, man, if you're, you know, took a break, say, hey, man, summon for Chang Lee, then I don't play anymore. Maybe you're well. If you got everything, you got everything. So, this, of course, is what everyone has been talking about since, you know, yesterday, day before yesterday. You know, special event to win the five star version of Chang Lee out for free. So this is just the uh, Moon Chasing Festival. You, we just got to do those things. It will begin this guy right there in the second half. Let me go back to this real quick. Right here, it looks pretty dope. Like I said, I can't wait to see, um, you know, what, um, you know, the Moon Chasing Festival all is going to be about. Of course, in the main picture, you can see it looks similar to like Lantern, right? If you ask me. <laughs> here's the uh land terms and like i said i'm not comparing it to Genshin or anything like that it's a chinese thing and a lot of people got to understand in a game that's also operated by kuro games that also comes out of china they're going to have same similar similarities so you're going to see chinese characters you're going to see chinese uh lore you're going to see chinese uh you know uh what is it you know them taking everything from the chinese and integrating that in the game so for me who play a lot of cn games i understand this very well not oh they're just copying off another person only uh, a genshin stand or somebody would say something stupid like that but yeah I, I like the chinese aesthetic that that weathering ways has i don't have a problem with it i don't need it to be all hippity or anything like that i think that's the approach like zzz is going they're not in that chinese space or anything like that it's more of this futuristic hippity type of setup that's why their characters look uh, totally different which i say i like that style too so i like this uh unapologetically chinese uh game so it is what it is but yeah man let me think let me, let me know what you think about this uh preview here it's not the full update but you know of course they just give us the preview i think jeji looks pretty cool um i liked her design but like i said i was gonna skip her anyway i wasn't really stunning her I got the units that I wanted, but of course, I know a lot of people are going to be saving and summoning for the shorekeeper unless she probably turns out to be maybe super broken or something. And I think that will entice a lot of people to summon. Now, for me, whether the unit is meta or not, it doesn't matter. Like I said, I think the unit is cool, but, you know, if I throw a couple singles in there and get her, I'll, I'll take her that way. But I'm not really chasing this unit or spending all my asteroid for her of course like i said i'm gonna be saving maybe for shorekeeper or who's after the shorekeeper so i have to see but uh yeah i can't wait to get shang li out in the second part so that way i can build him and use him with my yin lin so that's gonna be very very cool but yeah man like i'm subscribe man you already done so let me know if you're summoning for jeji or going for shang liao dupes or weapons catch you guys in the next one peace out